Today, we make a major step forward in the city's strategy to create a post-pandemic economy where most of the food we eat is grown and prepared by our neighbors. This topic was on everybody's mind. People were challenging us, asking us, begging us to see if on a going forward basis, the city could take a much more than a proactive role, a big role in doing things that had never been done before. And I think today is, is part of that. So we've started awarding $3 million in grants, $3 million in grants to 66 of Oahu's small farmers, ranchers, and growers who suffered financially during the pandemic. Today is a wonderful day for the people of Oahu and of course our Waimanalo community because uh, this is the first ever uh, city agricultural grants program and I am so pleased that the Blangiardi administration uh, supported the city council's efforts uh, to establish this program. To me, uh, food security and sovereignty and economic uh, diversification is not the kuleana of the state and federal governments. It's the kuleana of all of the levels of government as well as the community and private sector. So I'm so pleased because I'm hoping that through these grants, we could help to kickstart uh, more self-sufficiency with regard to food security and food sovereignty. And there's no uh, better place than this beautiful place of Waimanalo. Uh, this program is really important to food sustainability, which the department believes is to grow what you eat and eat what you grow. We need to increase the quantity and quality of the food we grow. And guess who's at the heart of that? It's the farmer. The supply chain begins with the farmer and this program, brilliant. It provides capital to the farmer to take some of the risk out of what they do for us every day. So it's a great program. I'm happy to support it in any way we can. Um, and speaking for all the farmers who receive these grants, this is seed money to us. And farmers know what to do with seed, we grow it. And so we, we uh, are going to grow with this money and multiply uh, what we're able to produce for the people of Hawaii. Uh, but even greater than the value of the money, to, to be honest, is the fact that the city is acknowledged the importance of the small farmer. And that means the world to us. Uh, and you know, often farmers are a little bit isolated because they're working all the time at their farm. And uh, this just shows the, the uh, the will of, of the community and the, the city government and, and the state government to help the small farms. So we are very pleased and honored to be included as part of the city's process for doing a road show that really brought this opportunity out into different communities across the county, across Oahu. Um, and sitting there, you know, one-to-one -one with producers, we can hear about their farm, hear about their challenges, see how we can help, how opportunities like this can help. So we're really pleased to be a part of it. And because it has been the priority of the mayor to get this underway. And we found a strong champion in council member Kia Aina and the support of all the council to get these small ag grants underway. We're super excited just to see what it means in real life and give you the opportunity to do that with us.